In this video, you will learn how to enable your Bluetooth device on your Hackintosh. This is specifically for Intel Wi-Fi card that has combo Bluetooth on it. I have a Wi-Fi card model AX210 variant with installed ITLMW.KX and Heliport app. On this macOS Sequoia Beta 7, using my ThinkPad T480. I will link on the description box for all the supported Intel Wi-Fi card that generally will work on this video. My current OpenCore bootloader version is 1.0.1. We will use OpenCore Auxiliary tool for editing the configuration. And we need all these kext file that was shared by Shaney of Insanely Mac Forms. Link is on the description box of my website. We will copy all those kext into our configuration file of our EFI partition of OpenCore that is located at OC and kext is folder. Then we will edit the config.plist using OpenCore Auxiliary tool or OCAT for short. Open up the OCAT app and we will mount the EFI partition as well as the config.p list. Choose which drive your EFI partition is located, then click the mount and open button. Copy the three Bluetooth kext files and we will put them up into our EFI partition of OpenCore. On the sidebar you should see the mounted EFI folder. Navigate into that partition and paste the files into the kext folder. By right clicking on an empty space, then paste three items. Now let's head back to OCAT app and click on the kernel section on the left side. The three Intel Bluetooth related KEX files are automatically added on the bottom part of the config.p list. Let's arrange the order of the KEX. There is a button on the far right of OCAT. Click it up so that the KEX can be reorder in this manner. Refer to this video on the arrangement that I made. I put the ITLWM KEX on the bottom part. Now let's click the NVRM section. Click the third item of the UUID. Click the plus button on the far right. We will now add two entries on this part. Credits to Lori's 89 for this info. Copy the text and paste it into the OCAT. I will provide this on the description box. Double click the empty row and paste it there. The type will be data, then put 00. Click the plus button. Now let's copy the second one. You can double click the text so that it will be highlighted, then copy it, then paste it into OCAT. Do this back and forth afterwards. Set the value to data, and let's copy the last value and finally paste it in. And we are done. Click the save icon above for us to save the changes on our configuration. You may now close OCAT and then restart your Hackintosh. Optionally, you can reset the NVRAM. You can press the space bar once you're in the boot picker of OpenCore and the reset NVRAM will show. This will reset the variables on the Hackintosh. This will restart your computer again. Link is on the description box if you have no reset NVRAM on your configuration. Now select the Sequoia partition to boot into it. Now let's check the Bluetooth on the settings menu. We have the Bluetooth icon on. Well, that's a good sign. I will try to connect this cheap Bluetooth speaker up. The Bluetooth device is ready to pair. The Bluetooth device is connected Let's try to connect them together now, and I will play a music on this one while adjusting the volume. If you encountered errors or unable to boot, you can follow the guide on your screen and see you there. 